the trailer just dropped for this new sir on the ultra b let's go ahead and check this out so this thing looks sick already dude i'm so excited to see more about this i hope there's some riding in this video forks look sick new controller I guess if you guys have been in the Facebook groups you've probably seen a little bit about this already though comes with hand guards what does that say 74 volt 55 amp not even 72 wow new motor I'm pretty sure it comes with oh you see those foot pegs on the back right there dude this thing is gonna be gnarly Oh, whoa. I hope we get this. Yo, that looks pretty crazy. Put the charger under the seat, I'm pretty sure. Dude. Dude. There's so much going on with this bike. It looks like it's got turn signals too, so it's probably going to be road legal. Yeah, passenger foot pegs. Ooh, those brakes look big, dude. Oh yeah, this thing is going to be a beast, but it is a lot bigger than the light beat. Let's go ahead and get into that now. So here's some pictures of it. This thing looks so cool, man. I like the gunmetal gray frame. It's almost like greenish looking. White and yellow plastics. Looks like it comes with a nice wide tire on there. Can't tell exactly what it says. Now, I've scoured the internet and here is some specs on the new bike. As you can see, the bike weighs 89 kilograms or 85 kilograms maybe. Um, it looks like it's got 12.5 kilowatts of power, 440 newton meters, 90 kilometers an hour top speed, um, 100 kilometers range maybe is what that is, 74 volt, 55 amp, 4.5 hour charge time I'm assuming. And then here's also some other stuff. Thanks to a dude named CJ in the Facebook groups, he translated a lot of this into English. Um, yeah, so you can see power output 12.5 kilowatts, maximum output, torque, everything we just went over. We got some more stuff here, power mode selection, economy, daily sports, fallen car. So four power modes it looks like. Um, customized seismic system huh it looks like this thing's got all types of new technology and it. it looks pretty sweet dude then we got something about the display here super wild what is this even saying um third level one click rapid adjustment no impact control Wait, i do see down there at the bottom though it looks like it's talking about it's going to be full road legal you're going to need a license and stuff and then here it looks like you got an app which is pretty cool because this will be the first suron with an app none of the other ones have had an app so far and it's talking about vehicle information and ota updates which is going to be pretty wild if this thing's got over the air updates bro I'm, I'm excited to see more about this and then more information about the battery here 74 volt 55 amp hour high performance lithium battery group a uh, new architecture um 1500 battery life cycles after 1500 it'll reduce capacity got stuff about the brakes here they look like there's some new design brakes specifically for this new shock um yeah, dude, this thing is going to be gnarly. I cannot wait to see more. But now the real question is, do I get one of these things? It looks sick, but it doesn't look like it's going to be the same kind of style bike that the Light B is. It looks like it's going to be a full-size motorcycle, basically, that you got to get a license for and everything. So, uh, yeah, I don't know. i got some choices to make. This thing looks sweet, though. Let me know what you guys think about it down in the comments below. Peace out. I'll see you in the next one.